Well, hello, my lovelies. Wasn't sure if I was live or not. Hello and welcome to day four of Facebook Live. And since this is mercilessly on a weekend, I thought I'd share a couple of special things with you from my home. So here goes. I am going to share with you the story of my dining room ceiling. So uh, when I was single, I used to always go to Most Holy Redeemer Church and they had this little side chapel that had a domed ceiling and in the dome were lots of stars and it was a little de chapel dedicated to our Virgin Mary and I loved it. So when Tom and I got together and we were building our new house, I asked Tom if there was any way he could build me a domed ceiling because I loved that ceiling so much. Well, he took on my folly and he built this uh, ceiling into our dining room. And it's actually, I've just realized it's really hard to show it to you because the room is relatively small and there's a table under it. So uh, Rose Hicks, a good friend of ours, was the artist and she painted it for us. And um, we just picked some designs and art books that we loved and we painted it and, and that was the end of the story for now. But when Tom and I moved here and we built this house and we painted that ceiling, we had just our first two boys, Tomas and James. And I was 40 at the time and I had, we had no idea if we'd have any more children. Well, lo and behold, we were lucky enough to go on and have Oshin and Edward. And it was only one day when I was in this room, sitting on under the dome, feeding Edward after he was born, that I realized that the painting was of a man and a woman and four little angels. So we had unwittingly painted our own little creation story. <laughs> So I love my living room ceiling. Thank you for letting me share it with you. And tomorrow I'm going to share something else precious from my home. Thanks for watching and I will see you again soon.